Hello, my name is Bram de Vries. I am from the Netherlands, but I live in Germany. And in my work as a 3D modeler for 3D printing, I do this with Blender, I came along with uh, some problems when it comes to architectural models and making them hollow for printing in color. It's uh, very nice to uh, save some volume and therefore money. So if we have this very simple yet very problematical model of uh, say a window and we want to give it a certain thickness and we would do that with uh, the uh, where is it solidify modifier and we want to have the thickness around two then you see some strange things happening and here the walls become very thin and even if we say high quality then uh, faces get overlapping and that gives a pretty ugly model with some printing issues. I've been experimenting some while on how to solve this and I stumbled upon something that I would like to share with you. So if we start with the model, first I make a copy of it, I move it to another layer and the other layer First thing I do is to make a kind of rougher model from it with uh, the nice uh, modifier Remesh. I do this smooth, so it already gets the nice feeling. Uh, don't make it too fine because one, you don't need it, and two, uh, a lower resolution gives a better result in my experience. So this is first what we have. We apply it, and then we do the Solidify modifier with a thickness of two. So if we have a look at that, we see that it's following quite quite nicely. Um, yes, so apply. Go back to edit mode and then we remove the outside. And now we still have quite a rough model, but we do the remesh trick again, smooth and make it three for example or even less no, less is two somewhere around three you need to do some experimentation also with the scale but normally with three i have good experience um, so now we have the inside of the model apply and if we have the outside of the model again and we look in the side view we see that it kind of uh, nicely follows the uh, the window so here it's a bit thicker so here is two millimeters it's a bit less than two millimeters and here at these corners is is a tiny issue left still but i think this is a this is a nice way uh, that applies to to most cases for for hollowing out your 3d model and then you send it to whoever prints it and then you save a lot of volume and you have a have a nice insight so i just wanted to share this with you and um, good luck with it